I'm Ben with the BTC Sessions, and this is your bullish bit brought to you by BitcoinWell.com, the simplest and quickest way to buy Bitcoin in the US or Canada and get it directly into your own self custody. Check them out today at the links down below. I'm bullish on Bitcoin only as a positive brand association. Um, we were talking about Cash App, I think. All of us are, are pretty full into Bitcoin only. And um, I just had a, a call yesterday with a guy who has a regenerative farm, had some grapes, a vineyard that was kind of like falling apart, um, just old, unkept, uh, to make some wine out of it um, using a, a winemaker who I am like basically hiring a winemaker who I'm uh, friends with, familiar with. And it, it was phrased to me as uh, he was a, a crypto guy uh, or doing a, a crypto wine uh, when I first heard about it a few months ago, uh, whenever I hear that from someone who then comes with, uh, well, I don't understand it. It's not my world. I don't know if they mean Bitcoin or if they mean crypto. Got a call from him just touching base, um, get to know the guy. I, I mean, I'm into regenerative ranching. So many of the things he's doing um, phrases it as he's a, a Bitcoiner or I uh, got into Bitcoin early, then got into Ethereum early, um, said something about how he thinks uh, maximalism is negative for the space. And then we started talking about like what he wanted to do with his wine. He, he reached out because he saw this, my Satoshi's Reserve bottle. I, I, there's a lot of ideas in crypto that are, that are intriguing to me. They're more like still so in the idea stage that it's hard to think long-term with any of this stuff. And especially if you're looking to actually build a product for the long-term, how can you even put yourself on one of these other quote unquote platforms and expect to exist in the long term? And so I just kind of been talking to him. It was like, man, wine is such a long term thing. Like the only way to build a community about it is to think long term and, and maybe want more wine in the future or hold this and age it. And then you could maybe sell it in the future and like your ownership is kept on the blockchain or something. But it's like, I, I, how can you even do that? in a world where we expect half of these things to disappear in a couple of years, if not more. And it just made me so much more like, how could you associate your brand if you're looking to build brands, not sales, because you can make money in crypto. If you're looking to build brand, you're thinking long-term positive association. How can you build a brand in anything that's not Bitcoin? If you're not trying to just get rich quick, if you're trying to build something that lasts, it really just makes sense to be Bitcoin only. So many people want to make a quick buck these days. And I understand, like, I've read books about Weimar Germany. We, people just with, with high inflation, with, when you don't see a positive hope for the future, you want to gamble. You want to take these, these um, high-risk things to get that, that big reward because you can't really see how you can make it just slowly and steadily. But I meet Bitcoiners and just like working in the Bitcoin world, it's just so obvious to me that if you can just build a brand, associate yourself with Bitcoin to get Bitcoin to get Bitcoiners to feel positive about you or associate Bitcoin with you to get the public to feel positive about Bitcoin. It's just such a positive feedback loop to build slowly long term.